Hi, this is Brian with Dana DJ, and this is a DNSC 3900 hybrid MIDI mode setup video for use with Serato Scratch Live. To obtain the Serato.xml mapping file and setup instruction document, please go to www.denondj.com and click on the USA link. Navigate to the DNSC 3900's page and scroll down to the support section. Click on the Serato Scratch Live mapping file link. If you are using a Mac computer, the folder is commonly saved to the downloads folder. If you're using a PC, choose Save As and save to a destination such as your desktop or downloads folder. After the folder is saved, right click on it and choose Extract or Extract All to extract the contents and follow your computer's prompts. Locate the README Mapping File Installation Guide document and double click to open. Please read the terms and conditions of End User License Agreement found on page 1. Before moving forward, be sure that you have the Serato Scratch Live software installed on your computer and be sure that you're running the latest version. After installation, you will need to copy and paste the mapping file to the Serato MIDI folder. So go back to the update folder and copy the sc3900 underscore map v1000 underscore ssl dot xml mapping file. If you are using a Windows computer, go to My Documents, My Music, Serato, then the MIDI folder, and paste the mapping file inside. If you are using a Mac computer, go to Music, Serato, then the MIDI folder, and paste the mapping file inside. If you don't see a MIDI folder in the Serato folder, you will have to create one. And be sure to name the folder MIDI using all capital letters. To load the file, open Serato Scratch Live and click on Setup. Then click on the MIDI tab and select the SC3900 mapping file and click Load. To exit, click Setup again. Each DNSC3900 needs to be connected to your computer via USB and the audio outputs from each unit need to be connected to the input section on the RAIN Serato hardware. The outputs from the Serato hardware will need to be connected to your audio mixer. In Scratch Live, check the Through option and select Relative Mode. Note that ABS is not supported. The MIDI channels on the DNSC3900 will need to be changed when using our mapping file. The left machine needs to be set to MIDI channel 5 and the right machine needs to be set to MIDI channel 6. To change the MIDI channel, go into the Utility menu, then select Preset Settings and scroll to MIDI Channel. press down on the parameters knob and turn until the desired MIDI channel is displayed. Press down on the knob to select and then press the utility button to save your change. To enter into the hybrid MIDI mode, simply press the MIDI button, then turn the parameters knob to the right until hybrid is shown in the display, then press down on the parameters knob to select. You can find the mapping assignment information on page 4 and 5 of the README document. Feel free to contact the DNM Professional Technical Support Department if you have any questions. Thank you.